This is a $5,000 first edition base set booster pack of Pokemon cards. You know, the original pack of Pokemon cards that could have a Charizard that's worth hundreds of thousands of dollars? Are we gonna pull trash or treasure? There's only one way to find out. I think I'm kind of crazy to be doing this right now. Apparently this was graded seven years ago and the original seller says that they did not weigh this thing. So we're gonna get to you in one minute, but I have something right now to get into. It's gonna be an EX Delta Species pack. So this thing actually cost me four $400. And there could be some really cool stuff in here. I mean, we could potentially pull out a gold star, an EX card, or even a really cool hollow out of here. So let's see what we get. Oh, and really quickly, I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm going to be continuing to give away all the newest Pokemon product. For today's video, I have five of the Evolution tins to enter the giveaway. Number one, smash the like button. Number two, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And number three, down below in the comment section, let me know how you think we're going to do with today's video. Because I'm really nervous for this one. So basically, I put it in this bag because when we break this, these things go flying. Now, I've never cracked the new ones before. What you want to do is crack the corner. And that thing goes flying if you don't have it in a bag. I need to stop skipping arm day at the gym. Oh, here we go. Okay. Now, this is the thing that comes in handy. Because once you have the two corners, you usually can pop this open. There we go. Okay, and then once you have that, oh, that's popped off, and okay, so now, actually I have a, I, I think, didn't I crack this before? I think I cracked these before. Usually these pop out, this is interesting, so these are not looking like they want to come out. Okay, I guess I could just pull it out. I think these before were like loose and you were able to pull them out. Hmm. Okay, so we got our pack out. We're gonna put this in here, we're gonna put this sort of the side, we have our pack, and yeah, it looks pretty good. We're gonna check out and see what we got inside. Let's see what we get in our EX Delta Species PSA graded pack. I mean, number one, we're gonna find out if this thing is actually authentic, which it should be. Um, and then number two, I guess we'll see if it was like maybe weight or what the deal is on this, but I don't I don't think I've ever, yeah, I've definitely never bought a graded pack and then cracked it out to see like what we actually get out of it. So, okay, I'm seeing cards, that's a good sign. Uh, I don't know the exact pack trick for this one. I think I might just do maybe like two from the back play it safe we'll do two from the back all right y'all we pull something crazy out of here though if we pull something crazy okay so we have holon transceiver we got Mitang, a delta species card we got tallow ditto but it's squirtle version i'll take it i'll take it cubone uh yo let's go come on coughing we should get at least like a really cool reverse out of here we got ponyta hopefully anyway oh hopefully it's actually correct Latios Rare Reverse! No shot, bro! Oh my god, it's the Delta Species type. It's a rare as well? Yo, that is actually sick. Okay, let me move on to the rare, though. Do we have a shot at something here? Do we have a shot? We have a shot! We got a hollow hit! Oh my god, bro! That thing wasn't weighed! That thing actually was not weighed! No way! Yo, okay, what? I was not expecting that. I'm actually really shocked. Not only was that pack authentic, but it had a, a hollow inside of it. Now, a lot of times when you have graded packs, they can be weight, but that pack literally just passed every single test. That's beyond amazing. I was not expecting that. So I got one more pack before we get to that first edition base set pack. This is a Call of Legends booster pack. This one's also graded in an eight. It has the Oxus on here, and I think it was around 450 or $500 total. All right, let's get this inside the bag. One more corner. There we go. Oh, that was a good one. Stuff just flies everywhere. All right, so, oh, that's it, that's it. There it is, okay. So yeah, use the screwdriver like that, and then voila, we have our Call of Legends booster pack. So these don't come out anymore? Yeah, okay, that's kind of weird. How do I do this? Oh, there we go. Okay, it just takes a little bit, and then it pops off, I guess. I don't know if they're like glue or something, but here we go. All right, so we got the booster pack out of here, and let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, yeah, I think it looks all right. Wait, 60% of you that watch the videos are still not subscribed to the channel. So you better subscribe right now so we can keep the lights on. Wait, no, I was actually kidding. I was joking. I was joking. Stop. All right, so Call Legends. I honestly think like almost every card in this set is amazing. It's the only set from that sort of like generation of cards. It was like a one and done set. It's b booster boxes are actually really expensive for this. I'm going to just stop talking, and I'm going to get into this thing and see if uh, we get lucky again. All right, so first thing I notice is I do see cards. That's always a good sign. <laughs> it's a good sign if you open it and there's not like 500 energies or something crazy. So we're going to do, let's just do two. Hopefully that's right. 
Call legends, cheerleaders, cheer. I think we're good. All right, we're ready to go. Cheerleaders, cheer. Can we do it again? Can we do it again? Professor Oak's new theory. We got Cyndaquil. Oh man, look at the background. Barely ever opened this setup. We got a Relicant. Got the cool borders on these. Got a Totodile and a Cyndaquil. Magmar. Dude, look at the fire on that. Such a cool set. Houndor, everything is just fire. All right, we got a Lost World. That's a reverse. But what's our rare? Oh, it's a Snorlax. And actually, there's another card back there. Jolteon as well. Snorlax not hollow. It's time for the moment of truth. The first edition base set booster pack. This is going to be the first time I've ever opened up one of these on the channel. I mean, except for the box that I opened up live stream like two years ago. But besides that, the only single pack. Whew. So is this weight is the question. And is it authentic? We're going to find out right now. These are the old slabs that they had, by the way. They used to just bend these crimps. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I don't want to talk about that. Into the bag you go. Let's get cracking. No going back now. See what I mean? These ones are way easier. There it is. All right. I am extremely nervous for this right now. <laughs> um, okay. Yes. There it is. Okay. Come on. Uh, oh. oh, it wasn't a perfect. It wasn't a perfect one. Okay. By the way, send these back in if you ever crack anything out so they take it out of the population. Um, okay. Oh, there it is. Oh my god. We got it out. Okay, I'm very nervous. Here it is, here it is. Okay. Um, let me get this out of the way. Whew. This is what I'm talking about. They used to they used to just like bend these in, so it's still like that when it comes out, so I don't know. I don't know about that. But anyway, we got a pack out. Um, apparently this was graded seven years ago. Unweighed, a first edition base set booster pack. First edition stamp there. Packs like this, loose, go for at least $5,000. This is the original of the original. But I think I've said enough. I think it's time to just crack this thing open. Now everything looks to be, for, as far as I can see, look to be okay. Whoo, man, my heart is pumping out of my stomach for this. Okay. Okay, here we go, here we go. Okay, we have an energy on the front. I hope that's not a bad sign. I hope that's not a bad sign. When have we started with energies on the front? Uh, let's go one, two, three from the back to the front. I hope that this wasn't... Oh, okay. That actually scared me for a second. My hands are literally shaking like crazy. All right, we have a first edition stamp. We have a Magmar. This looks to be good as far as I can see so far. We got the stamp. Shadowless. Guys, my hand is it's no joke right now. Okay. Okay, I think we're okay. I think we have a legit pack. We have a Pokemon flute. Each one of these cards is crazy. Like, even the energies. I actually cannot get my hand to stop shaking. This is actually wild. We have a Porygon. There's the energy that I saw in the front that freaked me out for a second. All right. Come on. We got a Vulpix. Squirtle! All right, nice. That's a good hit. That's a really good hit. Woo. We got a starter. We got a starter. We got a fire energy. Okay. Oh, Pikachu yellow cheeks. That's a pack right there. I actually feel like I might fight. I'm, I feel like I might pass out on this one. Okay. Keep it together, Ref. Keep it together. We have the Pikachu. We have the Squirtle. Is that... Is that <laughs> this pack is nuts! This pack is nuts! Squirtle, Pikachu, Bulbasaur, the $30,000 Bulbasaur, I gotta say. I gotta meme that. That is the original meme right there. Moving on to a Drowsy. Oh my god, okay. Okay. Whew. Whew. Are we coming up on it? No, oh, the rare is a trainer non hollow but what do you expect right oh man oh it's not quite thirty thousand dollars it's still worth three thousand dollars if it were to get a 10. this is going to be our most expensive card that we pulled honestly we didn't do that bad even though there wasn't a hollow but thank you guys so much for watching the video i hope you enjoyed that one if you did don't forget to smash the like button also feel free to click on one of the two videos at the top there hit that subscribe button on your way out i hope you guys have a great day and i will see you on the next one